you know, they believe that the best way to have uh, our youth uh, appreciate uh, the arts was to have a hands-on, interactive approach. And as you can see, that's uh, what's being used today. Has been successful for 32 years, and over those 32 years, uh, this particular arts camp has become one of the great traditions uh, in Shannon. You know, while it's, it's always important to remember that those people that got found at the original arts camp, we all know the, the success and longevity of this camp that is uh, attributed to the great leadership that Kelly has provided since 1991. Now, she always talks about her staff. And her so before I turn the microphone over to Kelly, I know the mayor would like to say a few words. I just want to uh, welcome everyone to the camp this year. Uh, it's always exciting. I look forward to it every year coming out and seeing what all you're doing. Uh, the parents, grandparents and stuff to bring your kids out here. Uh, I think it's one of those things Shenandoah offers and we should be proud of it. And, uh, you know, it's a great opportunity for them to come out. Just like Greg said, uh, hands-on opportunities. So I want to thank the volunteers, Kelly, and all, all of you for what you do. Uh, this is a great thing. I know people talk about it all year long. And so uh, thanks to everyone and uh, continued success. Thank you. showed up today. Um, this is our 32nd camp. It would have been our 33rd, except we canceled one year for COVID. <laughs> so um, I've been there since about the beginning. Marla came to join me about, what, eight or nine years ago because I was yeah. ready to throw in the towel. So uh, Marla's younger than me, you see. So <laughs> anyway, no, we're, we're a pretty good team, I think, and uh, all that. But that being said, you know, we wouldn't be here without the help of everybody here in, in one way or another. Either your uh, kid who's attending the camp, or you're one of our 16 teachers who are teaching. Oh, okay. Or um, you're on the board, like Jean Victor, our snack lady. <laughs> and Kim G, who was wandering around here somewhere. Kim, yeah. Kim does our um, fundraising letter and just comes up with lots of good ideas and exciting. She's got how many grandkids here? Two grandkids here this year. I have a granddaughter here this year. That's, that is great. Uh, Laura Danforth is also on our board. She does the scrapbooks and she's got a grandson here for the first time. In fact, so many kids were on, I guess, our, our third genera generation. Well, if you count us as the first generation, our kids came, and now our grandkids are coming. So that's uh, that. That is a lot of fun to see the.